there are several things really amazing to see here. Uh, first of all, of course, we have a car that uh, contains uh, graphene, a robotic arm that's being controlled by graphene sensors. We have seen a graphene wearable health patch. Actually, there's one on my arm. We have everything here from uh, artificial retinas to uh, different kinds of sensors. We have a lot of very good exhibitors, a lot of very interesting uh, uh, items being exhibited and covering a very wide range of different areas. So it's quite an impressive show, I think. Many visitors have come by and they have said that this is like fresh air in the whole Mobile World Congress, that this is a very different offer than the rest of the pavilions and the booths. So we feel very proud and very happy of everything that we have been able to do and also the results that we have got. If we look forward to 5G, or maybe beyond 5G, very high speed data communication, graphene is right there. And it can answer those questions that most manufacturers have and for which they do not have any alternative answer at the moment. In the demonstration we have here, Ericsson and Nokia, two companies, are leading. The demonstrator is a company grade component, not something done in the university. And really the next step is the integration in the business units of the company. Last year, if you compare the amount of, of prototypes which we demonstrated, it was quite small. But we learned our lesson, we communicated with a number of companies here. We learned ourselves what is required by the industry and we managed to adapt extremely quickly. And this year we presented many more relevant products. The overall aim of the flagship um, is to take the technology from the lab to the fab, um, take some technology that was a really great breakthrough at the time, take it further, take it to higher tier levels, and in the end make a difference for European industry uh, to create jobs in Europe, goes to improve the lives of European citizens. The Graphene Experience Zone has been a great success because now we have more interested people, uh, more companies visiting us, and, and obviously we are reaching the higher level in, in our own show, show abilities to, to tell what we are doing to the world. And this is actually one of the events that helps us greatly in doing that. Graphene can make miracles. I'm impressed. We can see how it's possible to charge mobile phones within seconds, for example, and it's all because of graphene. And I'm happy that uh, politicians uh, some years ago already, they decided to uh, invest uh, quite remarkable amounts of money in uh, those flagship uh, programs. Uh, I'm happy with those results we have already. I'm looking forward very optimistically. So my dream would be that next year's visitors come to this pavilion and actually have graphene product in their hand that they bought in the shop.